In this movie, I'll describe Labyrinth Valley, a copper plate engraving which I created in 2006. Labyrinth Valley was engraved on a copper plate that measures 8 inches by 6 inches. It depicts four imaginary labyrinths within four imaginary valleys. The valleys are also labyrinthine in character. Everybody loves a mystery, and labyrinths are mysterious. If you're outside, you wonder what could be inside. If you're inside, you wonder how to get back outside. You wonder what's around the next corner, and the next, and so on. Someday, I'd like to hear that someone looked at this engraving and discovered within it an answer to a problem. This engraving was inspired by a drawing that I sketched in a tiny notebook. The old Parker fountain pen was filled with brown ink. The final composition of the engraving adhered closely to the notebook sketch. The sketch and the engraving are part of a long string of my images dating back to the 1960s that have been described as labyrinthine which means that they are extremely complex in structure or arrangement. But my labyrinthine images include another characteristic. While they reveal great detail, they also conceal something. Thus, a mystery energizes each print. For example, Scenic Route Southwest, published in 1999, presents a highway system as a labyrinth built upon a pueblo. Dream 3 from 1994 presents a nightmare in which people take refuge in a labyrinth. Dream 1, also from 1994, presents sleep as a labyrinth of ideas. Idea, published in 1989, depicts curtains and screens that conceal something, but we don't know what they conceal. Thought, published in 1970, presents a labyrinth of string which reveals only one end, concealing the other end. 